now, KITV4 Weather. Aloha and thanks for checking out the forecast at KITV.com. Some interesting weather in the overnight and from yesterday afternoon, funnel cloud for Waihua, Kauai going under a flood advisory that has since been dropped. But if you look closely, there's those yellow and red cells just indicating that there was some heavier showers, some thunderstorms. So there's a potential with this instability and high cloudiness across the state that we could develop that into the afternoon with daytime heating. Because yes, uh, the trades have not returned. We're still dealing with light winds. Now our rain forecast model tracked this anytime online. A little bit more significant as far as moisture, not the most severe on our scale here, but definitely not the lightest of it. Now, as we wind down the work week and go into the first half of our weekend, this area does start to move away and slightly break apart, but notice how it never really leaves. So we're going to have to keep tracking that into the weekend, but overall stable dry conditions for the morning hours. The afternoon is when it gets a little bit dicier for the leeward slopes of some islands. Now that high cloudiness is going to continue. It's associated with that disturbance, keeping our trades out of the picture as this area lifts up and moves away. We're expecting that timing to be around the weekend. High pressure should fill in in the picture. But in the meantime, it's going to be hot. Hit the water if you can. Keep the fans and the AC on because it is just going to be sticky out there. Sandy Beach, not the biggest. In fact, most shores aren't going to be that big. But it's a good option to stay cool. And there's not going to be a lot of sunshine. But with the overcast conditions, still protect your skin with the UV rays. Maybe up to three foot faces for the west, east, south. Tomorrow, we're going to get a small bump out of the south, southeast. And that should last through Saturday maybe for some better breaks getting up to head high sets but generally ways to shoulder now no marine warnings got east to southeasterly knots around 20 no current swell and wind waves getting up to seven feet for today's conditions we were mentioning with that next disturbance coming through we do have already those high clouds blanketing out the sunshine but also in the afternoon increasing low clouds because light easterly trades to start and then by afternoon they shift out of the southeast that does provide some uncomfortable weather but also the chance of some pockets of heavier downpours brief and maybe the slight chance of thunderstorms this will be the case through our aloha friday but by the weekend that all awaited weekend for those of you who do get those uh, days off we're looking at perfect outdoor conditions with moderate trades filling back in overall dry plenty of sunshine to expect but then through this time next work week starting Monday, we fall right back in to light east to southeasterlies.